Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to unblock um, US Netflix. Um, now you you may realize that um, for quite a while uh, people have been using um, proxies and VPNs to access the different versions of Netflix or indeed to access Netflix from a country where it, you can't normally connect to it. Um, Netflix now is in most countries in the world it's in about 160 so it's it's kind of down to region locking if I'm in Spain or France I'll access the French or Spanish version of Netflix but um, I it, it, they lots of these different versions have um, huge differences in the amount of movies in them and by far the best is the US version of Netflix it literally has 10,000 odd more than some versions of uh, the different regions of Netflix so people want to access that you still need a Netflix account you can't get by that but um, what people do is use or used to use VPNs to connect through to make them look like they went into different countries so I'd sit in Spain I connect to a US VPN I get a US IP address and I'd go to the US version of Netflix which has loads more stuff and loads more up-to-date stuff as well Unfortunately, Netflix got a bit of pressure from the people who buy the media, the license they license the rights from, and um, they blocked it. And now, lots of media firms have been trying to block um, VPNs for a while, and they can't normally detect them. But Netflix came up with something pretty scary. They actually figured out a way to block not just based on region but on the um, classification of the IP address and what's happened is they just blocked any commercial IP address from accessing Netflix and nearly 99% of the VPN servers were on commercial servers they all sat in um, data centers across the world in, uh, in America and UK and they all had uh, commercial IP address suddenly they didn't work what would happen was you'd get this a message something similar to this like a streaming area, whoops, you seem to be using an unblocker or proxy. They blocked everybody who was using a commercial IP address. They only let through residential IP addresses, the ones you got from your ISP. Um, and none of the VPNs had this. Uh, so they all stopped working, and now it's in August 2016, and um, most of the VPNs are completely useless. They can't detect them, but they, they detect the classification of the IP address and block them that way. <coughs> Okay, well, fortunately, there is a fix. Um, a couple of the servers, uh, VPN services, have found a way around this and are working perfectly. The one I use is called Identity Cloaker, and uh, it was initially affected as well um, by the Netflix block, but now they've integrated some residential IP addresses into um, their network. So whenever you go to a US uh, one of their US servers you see here's the little thing um, what it whenever you you connect to a US server and then you try and go to Netflix it'll redirect you through a residential server so let me just show you okay I'm gonna connect to one of the US servers there I blurred out the IP address best to keep these low-key and um, I'm just going to minimize this here. So I'm connected to a US IP and it'll go to, I, I've got a US IP address now. And it all works exactly the same until I go to Netflix. Okay, so when I go to Netflix, it should log me into my account now. Um, what will happen is it will detect that I'm going to Netflix and reroute me through one of Identity Cloaker's residential servers. Okay, now there's not thousands of these. They don't use them for any other thing because they're kind of expensive um, and they want to minimize the bandwidth. But here I've gone through to the US version of um, uh, Netflix. So let me just show you. Here's my quick test. I would just search for Lost. Lost is not available any, on any of the other um, uh, versions of Netflix only on the US one. Let me just show you. This is where you get the streaming error when you press play. But here I've got a residential American IP address, not just a normal VPN IP address. Okay, you can see it's going to show there. I'm just going to stop it there because if I stream any of the actual content, my video gets blocked. Uh, but I just wanted to show you there. So I'm I'm sitting in the UK. I'm using a US VPN through Identity Cloaker. Uh, which is using a residential IP address only when I go to Netflix and it works. It works to unblock US Netflix and it works perfectly. Um, so I, I can recommend it. There's a discount code somewhere on the um, video here. If you, um, it doesn't work for the trial, 
try try the trial account first. It's ten days and uh, uh, a few euros, dollars, whatever. It's not much. Uh, try and see how it works for you. At the moment, the the US VPN for um, uh, Netflix will only work through the software. Uh, I identical you can use on your smartphone and tablet, but you set up the um, connection manually. At the moment, it needs the software, so you can only use it on a PC, laptop, or Mac to actually do this rerouting for um, the US uh, for the residential IP address. So if you need Netflix, you have to watch it through the computer at the moment. They say they're going to integrate it into the, the normal VPN thing. So if you want to use it on a tablet or smartphone or smart TV, you should be able to in the future. But currently that's not available. So you just have to use it through the PC. Um, you could connect the laptop, obviously, to telly or something like that. Okay, uh, well, thanks very much for watching. That's enough of my waffling. There we go. Um, unblock US Netflix. Enjoy. Bye-bye.